हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू जीके टुडे टुडे टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज व्हाई ई स्कूटर्स हैव बीन कैचिंग फायर इन इंडिया सो लेट्स स्टार्ट द वीडियो ओवर द लास्ट फाइव डेज देयर हैव बीन एटलीस्ट फोर रिपोर्टेड इंसिडेंट्स ऑफ टू व्हीलर इलेक्ट्रिक व्हीकल्स मेड बाय लाइक ओला ओकिनावा एंड प्योर ई एब्रप्टली बर्स्टिंग इन फ्रेम्स bringing to the fourth safety issue related to such vehicles especially the batteries that power them EVs are powered by lithium ion batteries which is a kind used in cell phones and smartphones which are generally considered to be efficient in light compared to their counterparts however they may also pose a fire risk as evidenced by the recent incident now we will understand what are lithium ion batteries and how do they work from electric cars to smartphones laptops lithium ion batteries are the most popular battery type today powering millions of consumer electronics around the world a lithium ion battery consists of an anode cathode separator electrolyte and two current collectors The key things that make a lithium battery better than other kinds are more suited for things like electric cars and smartphones are its lightweight high energy density and ability to recharge apart from this lithium batteries also typically have a longer life span considered to a lead acid battery a lithium battery can typically store 150 watts hour per kg as compared to a lead acid battery which stores only around 25 watts hour per kg in simple terms it means that lithium batteries offer more efficiency compared to other battery types while keeping the form factor of a product relatively compact which means an electric car fitted with lithium batteries will have a greater driving range and smartphones will last longer throughout the day however one of the biggest benefit of lithium batteries is its high energy density and can also be a potential reason behind the batteries undoing according to a data two wheeler ev batteries high energy density means these cell can become unstable in certain conditions and hamper functionality they work best within a safe operating limit and a battery management system that is bms is applied to a lithium battery to make sure they operate safely so why did the ola okinawa and others ev batteries catch fire the actual reason behind the ola okinawa evs catching fire are currently unknown as the companies have said they are investigating the matter However, Okinawa said that from its pre-observations based on credible sources, the media and the local authorities, the fire in its scooter was a result of short circuit due to negligence in charging the vehicle. However, these examples also serves as a cautious reminder to the consequences of fault within a Leon battery pack. According to industry experts a number of regions such as manufacturing defects external damage or faults in the deployment in the BMS could result in these batteries become a fire risk on the other hand temperature experts pointed out plays a tricky role in a lithium battery pack while lithium batteries typically perform better in warmer temperatures extremely high temperature could mean the battery packs ambient temperature could shoot up as high as 90 to 100 degrees which is when they become extremely prone to catching fire aside from that evs and electronic devices are equipped with hundreds of batteries together in a battery pack this means that even a few batteries malfunction and cause a short circuit it can kick start a chain reaction resulting in fire given that a battery pack is tightly packed with a number of lithium cells this effect is called thermal runway which 
according to expert is the reason why leon batteries burst into flames immediately so that's all for the topic thanks for watching